Okay, you starting? Mm hmm All right. Okay, guys, I am going to do a little matchstick cutting lesson. So this is the daikon, where, which we're going to use um, in our pickle. We're going to pickle it. And so I've cut a few. This is kind of what we're aiming for. He's going to show you, my videographer. Um, you know, you can make it super fine, but I think that's fine. I, I could cut this a little bit more, but um, something like that. So anyway, the, the one way I love to do use this Julian peeler, and that makes it super easy. You can just, you know, you get nice little shreds. And so I use it in salads a lot with carrots. Um, but of course you'd have to order it and it would take time. So for now, you're going to have to do it the old fashioned way with a knife. So I'd like to use this bigger chef's knife. Um, and okay, down back here. So you do it the way I like to do it is, um, just hold it, you know, hold your vegetable so it doesn't rock, but cut diagonal slices. So here's like a diagonal slice. So I'm gonna cut, okay? And then you just stack them. And there, then you get a whole bunch of them. Okay, and same with the carrot. It's a little smaller, so it's a little, and I would do that the same thing with cucumber or um, zucchini, any kind of round vegetable. And here is the carrot. Okay, one thing I did want to show you is jicama. This is also a nice vegetable to put in the Vietnamese um, summer rolls or lettuce wraps. Um, you just have, you have to peel the outside. And typically, uh, um, you can get it here. On, it's kind of tough. It's got some good texture. Oops. Um, you can get it at Trader Joe's already cut, but it's a lot cheaper at the Asian store. So it looks like that on the inside. It's just all texture. It's a little more unwieldy. So you would peel it. I just peel it with a knife because it's fairly thick skin. And then you can um, cut it into, you know, thin slices. You don't have to do a diagonal thing, just like that. That's easy. And again, stack it. So you could do this the day before. And actually these are great to eat even if you had bigger um, slabs. This could be like a chip. And this is great with guacamole or hummus, um, dip, any kind of dip. All right, that's um, matchsticks, thanks.